Tesla has launched new virtual power plants that pay Powerwall owners to end brownouts. Another way that you can make money by embracing the electric revolution. This stuff is really cool. I love it. Hello, my friends. Welcome to the channel. I'm the Electric Viking. My name is Sam Evans, and I'm coming to you here from Melbourne, Australia. I hope you've had an amazing week. Hope you've been tuned into the channel this week because there's been some crazy news this week. I mean, look at the CATL's new Kieran battery. Wow. Game changer, industry changer, solid state batteries, I believe, are basically dead in the water as a result. I mean, so many things are going on. Tesla's Shanghai run rate, 1.2 million to hit by August. Wow. Well, latest news from Tesla is Tesla has launched a new virtual power plant in partnership with PJN in California that will pay Powerwall owners to help stabilize the electric grid and end brownouts in California. This kind of thing is not going to, this is not going to be the first time. It's going to happen all over the world. A virtual power plant consists of distributed energy storage systems like Tesla Powerwalls used in concert to provide grid services and avoid the use of polluting and expensive Pika Power plants. Pika Power plants are ludicrously expensive. I mean, insanely expensive. You're talking up to 70 times more than the cost of normal electricity. And these things only power up, right, in extreme use cases. But when they do, they cost so much money that having a system like, for example, the big battery in Adelaide here in Australia has saved consumers literally millions of dollars. And of course, it's made the company that made that power, that big battery there, make a lot of money. You know, enough money, in fact, to double the size of that big battery. Now, Tesla launched a VPP in California where Powerwall owners would join in voluntarily without compensation to let the VPP pull power from their battery packs when the grid needs it. Today, Tesla's partnered with PG&E to launch a new version of its virtual power plant that will compensate people who are participating in this system. Become a part of the largest distributed battery in the world and help keep California's energy clean and viable. Opt into the Tesla virtual power plant with PG&E and your Powerwall will be dispatched when the grid needs emergency support through the Emergency Load Reduction Program, ELRP Pilot, you will receive $2 for every additional kilowatt hour your Powerwall delivers during an event. Adjust your backup reserve to set your contribution while maintaining backup energy for outages. Now imagine, right? Imagine you buy a vehicle, has an LFP battery, which can do what? What are they rated for, right? Around about a million million miles, right? Imagine after 800,000 kilometers, you're sick of the car, you've had it for 20 years. You're like, oh, it's old now, it's old, it's dated. I'm gonna get a new car. What do you do? Take out that big 60 kilowatt hour battery, right? The equivalent of six power walls and use it for home energy storage. All of a sudden, become part of the grid. Maybe you can make money out of that battery as well, even after having owned that car for 20 years. Now that's the way I see the future. It may not happen exactly that way in exactly your city, but something like it is gonna happen all over the world. This $2 per kilowatt hour amount is quite significant. It reflects how much value a virtual power plant can add to the grid in case of an emergency event where the grid needs more capacity. Now, depending on the events and the number of power walls homeowners have, they could earn anywhere from 10 to $60 per event or even more for bigger systems. Tesla lists some of the advantages of the virtual power plant with PG&E in California. Stabilize California's grid, clean the grid. Tesla will dispatch your power wall when the grid is in critical need of additional power. That is when the least efficient generators would typically come online. And also, I mean, stabilize the California grid. The extra capacity your power wall provides could help avoid or reduce blackouts in severe emergencies. This way, power wall can keep the lights on for both you and your community. Like you're kind of doing your community service here, really. Unite as a Tesla community. Team up with other Powerwall owners who are accelerating the world's transition to sustainable energy and help form the largest distributed battery in the world, potentially over 50,000 Powerwalls. As part of the VPP, your Powerwall will have an outsized positive impact on the grid over traditional demand response programs. Now, the great thing is, right, this is not just going to be the world's biggest battery. Essentially, that's what it is. It's also going to be the world's biggest battery, which will be powered by what? The majority of Powerwall owners get their power from where? Solar. I mean, seriously, apparently 
More than 70% of people who own power walls get the majority of their power through solar panels installed on their own roofs. This is renewable energy here in a massive way. Maintain your energy security. Powerwall will discharge during VPP events, but won't discharge below your backup reserve. Adjust your backup reserve to control your contribution while maintaining backup energy for outages. Tesla goes on to say, earn compensation. And you'll receive $2 for every additional kilowatt hour your Powerwall provides during an event. Tesla said it has 50,000 Powerwalls that could be eligible for this virtual power plant, this super big battery. That could add 500 megawatt hours of energy capacity that could be distributed during any event. And as the electric says, right? People don't fully understand how important this technology is going to be, how important it is already, but just how much more important this will be in 10 years time when, well, 50% of the population have their own battery, or even if it's only 20%, that would be enough. Only 20% would be enough for 100% during these kinds of events. It's amazing, it's such an exciting time. Such an exciting thing to be aware of, right? This is a way that we can become part of a global solution to our energy needs. It's going to increase the value of home battery packs, make renewable energy more useful, avoid costly grid brownouts, and actually it's gonna make, realistically, it's gonna make us the people capable of meaning, changing the grid. We can change the grid ourselves by having this renewable energy capacity, providing it to the grid, Therefore, the grid changes. For Tesla, this is going to turn the company into a major decentralized electric utility. For those of you saying Tesla's just a car company, time to shut up because that's wrong. Clearly, that's wrong. This is the biggest battery in the world. This is a major, major development. And it's going to happen in cities all across the world over the next decade. It's already in operation right now in Australia. It's in operation in California. Soon, it's going to be in Texas. Where's next? Could be your city. I don't know. Whatever the case is, it's an exciting time to be alive. And it's time to stop just saying Tesla is just a car company. Because frankly, it's clearly more than that. Thank you for watching. And let me know in the comment section below what you think. Am I, should I be excited? Am I too excited? Do you think this is a good thing as well? Let me know what your opinion is. And as always, have a great day. Bye-bye.